Taste good, it's like, go. Good. Get to work with amazing people and do amazing things. It was the best day of my life. Go on, Mr. Wheeler. Um, well, actually, the camera obscura is a, an optical device. Sort of like the grandfather to the camera. See, there's a hole on this side. I place a picture down of my dog. Aww. Aww. Let us say the alls for Mr. Wheeler's actual demonstration. <clears throat> so, light from an external source passes through, hitting a mirror on the other side, where the image is reproduced, but upside down. But the color and perspective stay the same. Can, can someone get the lights? Thanks. <laughs> wow, uh, sorry. Can someone get the lights in? So, basically the point is you don't have your selfie without the invention of this. Feast? Yes, very beast, as usual, Mr. Wheeler. Take a seat, as we shall now see if Miss Martin's synapses have allowed for a new Big Bang to occur, or simply another catastrophic avalanche of gray debris. Would you care to grace the class with your project? Or would you like a pillow? I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry. I haven't been sleeping well. You seem to be sleeping just fine in my class. <laughs> sorry! Use of technology. Hey, I thought teachers were only allowed to give us high fives and fist bumps. This is against the rules. Somebody video and post it. Call my lawyer. I like to talk about travel in regards Brand. to. And I would like to see you journey to a conclusion. Traveling without moving, to be exact. If 
You take Eisenberg's theory of relatives? I believe you mean Einstein's theory of relativity. Right, that's what I said. Uh, his theory states that time-space is a fabric. Oh, like spandex. <laughs> if you were to fold that fabric, bring the light from there to here, it could create a wormhole. Ew, worms. <laughs> Wormholes are purely theory, not provable physics. Although I do wish you could travel via wormhole, Miss Martin, and bring back a real presentation. But I haven't even discussed cosmetology. I mean cosmology. Take your seat, Miss Martin. You are supposed to do your project on scientifically testable physics, not theories. A C, Miss Martin. Why? This is based on my mother's theory. Uh, make that a C minus. Other students actually put effort into their projects to show how physics really works. Just regurgitating what you see on Star Trek doesn't cut it in my class. You are a C minus, Miss Martin. Average minus. Ooh, I'm glad we beat the red coast. Miss Martin. <laughs> Grams, I worked really hard on my project and all he did was judge. Mr. Frothingham's your teacher. My tax money pays him to judge. I can't believe I have you in detention and you suspended? You know how I count on you for the afternoon rush. But the tattoos are only temporary. Frothingham was right about one thing. I'm just average. I don't fit in anywhere. I'm not pretty enough to be with the popular girls. I'm not smart enough to be with the brains. I can't name the cast of Star Trek, so the geeks don't want me either. I'm a C minus. Average. Yes. Really? Leave me alone, Icky. Alexandra, this is no time for video games. Uh, but this is Tiger Trap. You have to lead a tiger into a trap, and then boom, he's caught. Put it away. And Mickey, you sound just like your mother did at her age. I read her papers, Grams. I'm nothing like her. <laughs> True that. Shut it, Slacks. Anything for you, Icky. The only thing keeping you from reaching your mother's potential, Michelle, is you. <sighs> Both you and Alexandra are from their DNA. They were extraordinary physicists, and even better parents. You keep telling us that, but how come if you search them, nothing ever comes up? All we have are some photos and some of Mom's old papers. You two are grounded. Grounded. But it's the weekend. Can we table this for, say, Monday morning before school? You don't want to be treated like a child. Stop acting like one. Everyone else's parents. And I'm being raised by a rooster. I'm calling child services right after a snack. Worst day ever. When you get to be my age, you've seen a lot worse. Hey, I want your mother's papers back too. But you gave them to me. It was a mistake. Leave them on my dresser. She's becoming more and more like you every day. Mow the lawn? Well, what happened to the landscapers? I'm looking at them. Why don't you just send us to the chair? It's faster. Here's a little spoiler alert. It would get done much faster if you help each other. One day, you won't have anyone to depend on but each other. Lethal injection? By the time I get home, girls. Please tell me there's another world I can send you to. You okay? What are you doing here, Wheels? You're probably better off going further down the block. That's where all the popular girls like Marissa live. Who? Oh, right. Uh, well, do you have any sandpaper?
Anyway, I'll ask again. Why are you here? Just wanted to talk. Well, as you can see, I'm a little busy. Sometimes they rust. Make a deal. I'll mow your lawn. Talk after. I was thinking about your concept. The 2M idea? 2M, what's that? Traveling. W. With. O. Out. M. Moving. The wormhole? Sorry, right, the C minus idea. There's nothing remotely C minus about you, your idea. Whoa! What you're saying is that if we could pull the distant light to us by, you know, pulling the fabric of space time, that we could step into that light and go somewhere else? Right, something like Einstein's gravitational lensing. Sort of like a telescope that you could travel through. A wormhole. Sorry I'm wasting your Saturday. I don't feel like I'm wasting my Saturday. How'd you think of this? Not my idea, my mom's. My gram showed me her old college thesis. I think she was my age when she wrote this. Our age? She must have been a genius. Graduated from college at 17 from Plimpton. Never heard of it. Really? It's this huge science school. Better than MIT or Harvard. Uh, well, where is it? I don't know exactly, but I know it's amazing. Apparently, she believed two rooms possible. I always had this fantasy that if I could recreate her physics, then maybe I could find a way to save my parents. It's dumb. Not dumb. Um, what, ha what happened to your parents? They died in a car accident. They were both scientists? Yep. Both scientists, both PhDs, both gone. <clears throat> um, well, um, since I'm not gone, and you're not, I, I was wondering. Where'd you find that? Stuck to the bottom of Grams' drawer. You went through her things? Shouldn't you be asking why Grams has a crazy, mad, futuristic bunny watch instead? Put it back. Put it back now. Lex. Give it back, Icky. Give it back, Icky. A bunny. For stack. What do you think it means? I do K, but I think I know who might. Aren't you missing the Star Trek marathon this weekend? Principal Sheehan, I am doing precisely what teachers do on the weekend. Grading papers. The district announced the nominees for the Diamond Teacher Award. From your demeanor, I'll assume I am not one of the anointed. There's no doubt you're the best teacher at Southview. Physics just isn't sexy enough. Physics is plenty sexy. But you don't win the Diamond Teacher Award sitting in the classroom. Have a nice weekend, Vince. Principal. Ah! 
Uh, Mr. Frothingham? You got to throw something at me. Get back. Get back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Mr. Frothingham? Oh. Um, are you all right, Mr. Frothingham? Oh, and you, Wheeler. I always give the new kids a month or so before they fall in with the delinquents. Mr. Frothingham, I'm really sorry about yesterday. Oh, that's what Charles Manson said. Who? We're wasting time. Show him. Oh, oh, oh my lumbar. Ah. Maybe it's alien. Your parents were world-renowned physicists, yes? Any chance you were adopted? This will take careful analysis and evaluation. Time I do not have. Here. Why did I even think you would help? Fair stag. Does it mean anything to you? Wait. It's gravest. What? Haven't any of you ever played words with friends? By Einstein's hair. It looks like mom's handwriting. Mr. Wheeler. What do you make of these? Physics equations? Yes, yes, equations, but, but diagrams as well. Well, I should just... Hey, it's our watch. Yes, of course. These look like equations to build technology that pulls the quantum information from light, creating a fold in space-time. Like a black hole. Don't be a child. No, like a wormhole. Exactly. Miss Martin, look at these equations. Some are problems that have puzzled physicists for decades. So do you think these could be plans for a localized wormhole? Discovery leads to experimentation. Does experimentation lead to a new grade on my physics project? It is not your project. My project was on travel in regards to a wormhole. Mr. Frothingham, please give me a chance. But you so much as throw a piece of chalk at me. I promise, no chalk. We begin first thing tomorrow. Who are you? Hey, doesn't gravest mean serious or danger? Yeah. What if it's a warning? What if it doesn't want us to build that tech? What are you doing? Looking for uh, a can opener. The can opener's in the kitchen, where it's always been. Told you. Thanks, Grim. We will meet here every day during detention. Okay, Vicky, throw it! 
try again, try again. You put in the coordinates from the football field, right? The ones you gave me, yeah, absolutely. Okay, but where did all these other coordinates come from? Simplex? Multiplex? I don't, I don't know. Maybe Lex was messing with it. But the one set is definitely for the football field. We're ready. Turn it on. This work, Miss Martin. Teacher Award with insignificant goals. You have cracked the holy grail of physics. Created the means to close the distance between two points. This one's being published. We're talking Nobel laureates. Nassau may even be able to use this to travel to other worlds. Uh, yeah, speaking of the worlds, Lex, what's with all these coordinates? Wow. I didn't do that. They all look so similar. Multiplex? Let's try one. Careful. We need to test the new coordinates first. This is advanced technology. Proof first. Or we could open Pandora's box. Oops. That does not look inviting. Don't even think about going in. Grams, what are you doing? That thing you built. It's a curse. Uh, Mrs. Martin. Your granddaughter has built a wormhole under my mentorship, of course. Yes. Yes. No, it's not a chicken pot pie. I don't know what you've done. That thing is the reason why your parents are gone. You said they died in a car accident. I'm not sure. They built that. We went. And, and now I can't see them again. Are mom and dad in there? Mom and dad are alive? I don't know. All I know is they're gone, and nothing will ever be the same. We can bring them back. Don't go near Miss Martin, it hasn't been tested. Don't go near there. Alexander, relax! I love you, Grams. Give me 30 minutes. Mom and Dad. Why? Because you're just a kid. So are you. I'm a bigger and older kid. And uglier, too. We're marching right back through that door. If Mom and Dad are here, don't we have the right to know what really happened to them? Come on! 
Going through a wormhole and rescuing your long lost parents will give you street cred. What does your poster say? My poster says a lot of things. Pick something. You only live once? You only live once! There you go! We gotta go back. It's gone! Dr. Marty, all access update. I can't breathe. What? What's, what's wrong? Mickey! Okay, we'll go back! It's not working. It's worse. Get help. Well, the, the door's gone. Call Graham. Very good idea. There's no signal. So why isn't it working? Sign help. I see buildings. I'll get help. I'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Right now. Oh, I didn't mean it like that. I know you. Okay, okay. okay. Well, it, it was in the name of science. She, 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 she wanted, she wanted a better grade. Do you know what you just created? They didn't just go to a football field. They went to another world. Oh, Mrs. Martin, I realize that many worlds is is vanilla physics, no. but it's 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 still only a theory. It's never been proven. Or proven my feathers. Tell that to my Mrs. This Smith. is not going to help. Really hurts. I'm coming, kiddo. Hold your horses. There's no one here. Keep looking. She couldn't move when I left her. We need you back at the base. Copy that. I'm on my way. Come on, kiddo. Let's head back and figure out who you belong to. Have fun with that. I'm finding Mickey. Let's get your folks on the horn. Soon you'll be back home safe and sound. Access granted.
told you. My name is Alexandra. My friends and family call me Lex. I'm 13. My sister's name is Michelle. Everyone calls her Mickey. I said I was looking for my sister, which is what I should be doing. Hold your horses, Missy. Missy? Kiddo? Where'd you guys learn to talk like that? Enough of the back sass, kid. A few more questions, and then you can skedaddle. What are your parents' names? Victor and Eva Martin. That's a sick joke, kid. Dr. Victor and Dr. Eva Martin's children died in a fatal car crash years ago. Silver disc? <laughs> this is like some advanced technology. A giant DVD. Hello, our new Martin lab will power my partners, Dr. Victor and Eva Martin, in our I'm journey dead. to revolutionize. So let me get this straight. You are the deceased child of Dr. Victor and Eva Martin? No. Oh, but, but yes. I'm not dead. Am I? But yeah, they are my parents. Why don't I just pick up the phone and ask your parents about their ghost child? Wait, my parents work here? Well, yeah, they've been... On sabbatical. Yeah, calling's here. Uh-huh. A blip? We've had success before. But this new invention puts us on a whole other level. We truly believe we are on the precipice of proving Everett's many worlds theory. That's me? But how could that be me? I cannot ask for better partners than my wife, Eva, and Mr. Burstad. Mom and Dad work for the gravest for Stack guy? Where am I going to find this for Stack? Well, I guess I'm in the right place. Look, I apologize for the ghost talk. Just sit tight, sweetie. We're gonna find your sister. Martin's watch. Go sit, hold the kid. First step will index. <laughs> Why don't you tell us? I have to pee. Get her out of there. I'm coming in to check on you. Okay, Lex, you're super smart. Think.
We're supposed to be dead, but we're not. She said we're sad, which also spells gravest and can't possibly be a good thing. Mom and Dad are here. We have to have an office. That's it! But how am I supposed to find that? Where's that damn kid? She's heading for the Martin's office. So, that's why Mickey couldn't find anything on our parents. And that Plimpton University, that's in the other world. Cool. Uh, not cool. Dangerous. We need to get them back. Now. And you're coming with me. Me? Uh, it's, uh, me? Well, Mr. Frothingham, you did always want to get out of the classroom. She can't get in without the pass. to find Lex and my parents. Lex first, then the lab. I wish my parents invented a time machine. Mickey, where are you? I need you. Lex? Ow! Oh my god! Mickey, are you dead? Oh my god, you're dead! Maybe that guard was right. That means I'm dead too. Lex! Mickey! <laughs> I thought you were dead. Why? Because the security guards chasing me said that we're both dead. You have security guards chasing you? What did you do? I'm oh, missing the point again. Shouldn't you be asking how we died? How did we die? In a car crash. Graham said mom and dad died in a car accident. <sighs> Mickey, all the guards are wearing watches just like Graham's. I saw mom and dad. Where? On a silver disc. A silver disc? It's a flat turning silver disc. You saw them on a flying saucer? No, no, no. Anyway, they're here in a lab. That's what the flying saucer told you? See? I see, all right. Where'd you get that watch, Mickey? How does he know your name? I don't know. Run! This is 
like being in seven periods of gym. Go! They're heading your way. Here for Ted and Mom and Dad are alive. When we find them, they've got a lot of swing. Those are the security guards I told you about. Still have a lock on them. They should be right there. We're in over our heads. We need help. Oh, we don't need help. We just need to get to the lab. How are we gonna find the lab without GPS? A campus map. Duh. I don't see it up. They're behind you. Enough of this cat and mouse. Come on, girls. Indexing doesn't hurt. I don't think that's gonna work with my outfit. What is that bracelet thing? They call it uh, being indexed. I don't like the sound of that. Are you nuts? Well, I'm not getting indexed. I'm not going to get away. What? Watch. So don't even think of jumping. Bravo! Girls, go with it. What? Time to go. What? What did he mean, the watch? They're tracking us. Wheels, you man the throttle while Mr. Frothingham and I go bring back the girls. I'm... I'm not really the action hero type.
$1 million lab in a basement? Looks like a prison. It worked before. This could be a thousand different numbers. Well, well just think, people use personal references, uh, pet names, home addresses, their college. Parents always use their kids' birthdays. You remembered my birthday. Of course. Access printed. came all this way. Michelle. Eva, I found the um... Why did you leave us? Why does this world think we're dead? Because in this world you are. We gotta go. Now. I never thought we'd see you again. Found us. You are extraordinary. These red bands. What's in this? It was a mistake. No time to explain. By Einstein's hair. Wow. Eva? Mom? Ah, this is what I like. A little dysfunctional family reunion. Index them. Ah, index them. That's a beautiful concept. You see, your parents' little indention. They did not tell you. Grab the watch. Stop! No! No! Stop! No! Don't struggle. No! 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 It's nice. I like it. It's feisty. Ah, the chair. Look how beautiful you are. So grown up. I'm so proud of you. You have succeeded where your parents have there. You have brought the there here. We didn't actually bring the there here. 
More like the there, there, no, 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 Hanka. I used to have to go there, now I bring Hanka to me. No longer do I go to Mars and take a year. I can go to Mars and be home for dinner. I will never let you have it. Prepare to be disappointed. Uh, no, Mickey! You see, no, you see, that's the problem with short-sighted thinking. You know, that's what happens. Now look, you're going to be indexed. You understand? I want something. I want the wormhole, a new one in 24 hours. You understand? 24 hours? Yeah. Well, you can take ours, just leave them alone. Well, they can't take the one we built through itself. You see, quantum mechanics, no, 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 no need to hit that button. I'm totally... Now, I have been patient. You have been stalling for 10 years. We're not stalling. You need incentive? We just don't want to give Bye, it to you. Bye, I give it to you. No! Krams! 24 hours. Krams? Enough. Krams. Enough. Where? Now where's the little one? Find her. You have become a monster. No. You see, I know who I am. It is you who does not know who you are, partner. Now take the little old lady and put her in the wormhole and destroy it. 24 hours. Index them. I'll see you in 24 hours. You're his partner? Don't believe everything you hear. No, 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 no! 24 hours, it's not a long time. Okay? And then everything will be fine. I'm trying to make it work, you see? You got it. Good. 24 hours. Good, now go. See? I'm nice. When I'm nice, things happen. Get rid of it. Get rid of it. Get rid of this garbage. Wait on the other side. I'll set the explosive charge. You can't destroy it. I won't let you. Uh, right. Ditto. You know where the lab is? You people need a plan. Contact me through the lab. Turn it off. When I leave. What? What's that mean? It's done. Ah, good. When one door closes, the other one opens, yeah? <laughs> and you saw the wreckage from the accident. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Ah, good, good. It's the same children. They built the machine, yeah? Yes. Yeah, yeah, the extraordinary children. Yeah. Now, once the Martins finish my wormhole machine, yeah, yeah? Come, come closer. 
I want you because you are my right hand man. Not you. Don't take offense, but you are my right hand man. I want you to dispose of them, right? Right? Put the hand up. Let me see. Let me see. Yes, right hand. Right hand man. That's you. Right hand man. Let's go. One more. For good luck. Right hand man. Here. Why don't you help me turn the handle? Do it. You won't see it coming. You coward! Sorry, I got you indexed. Oh, I always wanted to see how the other half lived. We came here to find my parents. And what we found are two people whose inventions have done nothing but bring horrible things. My grams. These bands. They're as bad as Verstag. Well, you, your, your parents didn't give Verstag the big invention. We did. But it was their plans. Well, you can't blame the technology. A bicycle cannot go without a person pedaling. We're not talking about a bike here. They designed it. We built it. But no matter how benign, all technology has its goods and bads. Rams, you were right. We should never have built this thing. I'm listening to that jerk for a stag. And then I see your grandfather on the green hill. And now I see you. But you died. I saw you die. They killed you. Kill me? Why would that guard Greco kill me? He didn't kill me the first time. Nobody kills me twice. We gotta get your parents back. First stag is going down. Helping them with their physics project would get me trapped in their physics project. Olivier, uh, Xavier. This is so beneath me. I could have been a great physicist. Now I am a male boy. What are you doing? Accounting. Ever heard of a computer? Just give me my mail. How about email? Molly. Just give her her mail. Good luck. Instead of manual labor, we are forced in a life sentence of menial labor. You've been indexed. my benefit package? That's got to be one bloody good benefit package. Plan? Plan? 
So we're here, and your parents, Mickey and Mr. Frothingham, are there. If we could get them together. Then we could get them out. That's it. Over there, 2M is going to Woods. Sorry, my props are in sales. It's the best I can find around here. And where are your parents? The lab. Are Mickey and Mr. Frothingham at the lab? No. So, your parents are at the lab. Can we point the projector towards the lab? Yeah, uh, with the watch. No go. Mom and Dad are with the watch. We take that. And the bad guys will know for sure our 2M is working. So what do we do? We'll have to go there and get the coordinates from your parents. No. I'll go with her. Stay together. You guide, and you bring her back. Now your parents are out, but what about Mickey and Mr. Frothingham? Greco, we'll bring them. Just go with it. And once everybody's in the lab, we open our 2M. And everyone runs for the open portal. Exit strategy. Wait, wait, wait. So we're just gonna walk in there and get the coordinates? This is a bad plan. We're gonna get caught. Keep your tiger stripes on. We've got this. Just leave the clipboard. We need both your signatures. We'll be back to pick it up later. Stag Industries here. Here's the man of the house. Hello? Hello? I can't do this. I don't care what they do to me. I don't care. Actually, a cup of tea would help. Hello, this is for Stag Industries. I could care less about directing your call. Let's go. Do it, you coward! You already killed my grandmother! Hazel's alive, Mickey. What? Sit okay. down. But what do you sit down? We don't have much time. Your parents were going to turn evidence against Versteg. 
he found out and ordered me to kill you and your sister. So we staged the accident to get you to safety in the ultimate safe house. Your parents never stood up again for fear that he might find you. They never gave her stake the wormhole technology. The projector was destroyed. At least I thought it was until you showed up. That's why Grams didn't want us to have the watch. Oh, she obviously dropped the ball on that one. So we are from here. Why are you telling us this now? I need you to trust me. You indexed us! You turned me into a male boy. I need you to go with it. Stop saying that. You said that before we jumped off the building. Go with it. You said that to my parents before the accident, didn't you? I did. Now I need you to go with it. The other projector is set to get you and your family out of here. And me. And uh, me too, right? Oh yeah. I'll be back to get you to the lab. Wait. <laughs> How are they going to point the projector at the lab? I have no idea. Be ready when I get back. Steg is anxious about his investment. Good job, Lex and Wheels. This coffee's as bad as what they serve in the teacher's lounge. That's why I drink tea. Why would my parents not destroy the watch? Perhaps they hoped it would be used for good. It's time. Ever heard of an electric pencil sharpener? Older technology is easier to control. Right. When I get you to the lab, your friends will open the portal, and out you go. What about my parents' projector? It doesn't matter. You'll be safe. We can't run and leave Verstag with that kind of technology. Actually, running sounds great. We need to go. Leaving Verstag here or anywhere else with that kind of power is wrong. He'll control everything. Well, so he controls everything here. So what? At least he's not in our world. But he could be. Wait, what did you just say? At least he's not in our world. Mr. Frothingham, you're a genius. That's it. Tiger trap. Come on. In. You call me a genius. Ah! <laughs> Perfect timing. 
me as usual. Okay, turn on the machine. Our 24 hours isn't up. Oh, I, I stay. I, I'm excited. Can't the man be a little early? I'm early. Big deal. What if all the bolts aren't tight? What happens if all the bolts are tight? I don't know. We'll see. All right, 10 seconds. You ready, Lex? That's not going to be. Okay, five, four, three. Please, in, in. You aren't using them as test subjects. This wasn't part of the deal. Deal? <laughs> deal? I refuse to send my daughter into the unknown. Oh, please, do not give me the caring parent routine. Turn on the machine. I refuse. No. No? Okay. Boom! Stop! Don't hurt them. We'll go. We? No, Mickey. No. Mom, Dad, I've done it before. It's okay. We'll go with it. We'll go with it! You see, your daughter says we'll go with it. It's so mad and she's so brave. Now look, I'm getting kind of tired of this. Turn on the machine. Two, one. to go. Come on, kids. Where are they? No! No, 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 no! So, why is this machine still working? You were supposed to destroy the other machine. What happened? The, the bomb, it, it burnt out. Are they stuck? Are they stuck in that other world? I, um, the spear ball! There's a spear ball! Your days of putting profit over people are over. Are over? My days of sacrificing people for profit are over? Hey, so, so, please, could we have a private conversation in another, maybe over here? It's okay if we go over here for a private conversation. You are blaming me for other people's pain. It's simple. I provide a service. You buy the service. You don't buy the service, I disappear. Poof. But now, you disappear, poof. Why? Because you are a traitor. T R A Y T E R. Traitor. Finish him! Kill mode engage. There you are.
wait, 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 we have new coordinates. About time. Oh, you broke my nose! Even a physics teacher can be an action hero. Wait, this is not Hong Kong or Seattle! No way! In other words... Okay, good to punch go. Punch it! We are stuck in a crazy mother world! No, <laughs> you're stuck. Oh. No, I am hardly stuck! Finish them! Gladly. That won't work here. I'm canceling my service. But why? Why? I didn't do anything. It's not fair. I'm a good person. I try. I wake up in the morning. I do the right thing. And she gives it back. Tiger trap. Brilliant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and you don't even play the game. Miss Martin, you were truly outstanding. Make that an A plus. Thanks, Mr. Frothingham. Oh, come on in here. Come on. <laughs> okay. But what are we going to do with it now? We can't make another Verstag. We have to make sure that 2M is used for the good of everyone. But how? Share it. Open source. Brilliant. Sounds like a team effort. I'm in. Count me in. Distance relationships. You ever feel like you're from another world? Yeah. The most important part of creativity is a warm atmosphere. And the filmmakers make a wonderfully warm atmosphere here. If you're going to stay relevant in this business, you're going to need young people who are interested in technology, who are also uh, familiar with the traditions of film. No one has ever figured out how to make a world home. If you could, it would be spectacular. I used to live there. It was awesome here. We went on a food truck because that's where a scene was being taken. I'm so happy for myself that I did this. You get to work with amazing people and do amazing things. To be on the actual set, it helps fuel my passion for filmmaking because I plan on becoming a good director. My favorite scene to shoot was the fight scene because it was a lot of extras. Feeling like I'm a part 
of a movie. Nobody I know can say that. Seeing all the different things that go into lighting, cameras, sound, is a really good experience. Actually seeing the actors, normally you see them on the big screen, but now you actually get to see them there in front of you. Kind of cool knowing that when this comes out, you're going to see this. This isn't something that an ordinary teenager does. It was like one of the best days in my life. It was honestly so, so cool. I got to do the boom. I got to shadow the director. I'm also excited to be using the camera. I'm glad to be a part of the film because it's a once in a lifetime experience. I am most excited to learn about video editing this week. It was just a very fulfilling dream just to be here.